Hello people, Yolanda here, Day in the Life. First I want to apologize for the camera angle and all that stuff. Still doing things from home using my cell phone and my PC. But today I'm here to talk about the Jin Hao Chinese Dragon Luong Bronze Basso Relievo Fountain Pen. That is a long name for a fountain pen, but that's what they called it. Um, it is a, ooh, it's got a relief of a dragon on the, uh, on the outside, which makes it really look to me great. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'll try and get a decent picture of it. It's got like dragon head and dragon body with, um, ruby, um, or red crystals for uh, eyes. I've had this pen a long time. I think I bought it in like 2018 or something like that. And I've had it so long that one of the gems has popped out. But uh, it's, as far as I'm concerned, it's a really nice looking pen. It's a screw cap. And it screws on the back here. Um, and then it's got a 18 karat gold platinum stainless plated, gold plated stainless steel medium nib. Um, like most Jin Hows, it takes a international standard cartridge. Um, but, uh, I've got a, uh, what you call it? ink converter in here or cartridge converter um the pen weighs 0.32 ounces it is 5.2 inches long by 0.6 inches by 0.6 inches so um, if that means anything to you, I would say it's probably like a medium sized pen. It's good for people who have large hands. It's a decent sized pen. Mm. Okay, I'm looking at my notes here, and I've had this pen since 2016. This was kind of like my second fountain pen. Um, I started with the Pilot Varsity, and then I saw this on Amazon and I had to have it. Um, the pen is filled with Robert Oster Fire and Ice. And even though it's kind of like, you know, it's got this 3D thing on it, it's pretty comfortable. Let's see, Robert. Mm -hmm. Um, it rarely skips or start or hard starts. It's pretty reliable. And I enjoy writing with it. Um, being what it is, a Jin Hao, I, there's not much flex I don't think you can get out of this. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, any questions, you know, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe. And, uh, I will get back to you next time. Talk to you. Bye.